Hi, I'm Mayor Andy Skibisky. Welcome to the Westville Farmers Market. I'm here with Chris Devine, who actually manages this wonderful event. This is the 22nd year the Westfield uh, Greater Area Chamber of Commerce has been hosting the Farmers Market. And uh, Chris, terrific job. Thank you very much. We welcome everyone. Looking forward to another successful season. So talk a little bit about the vendors that we have here, the farmers. So we have, um, we have three farmers, uh, of which one is organic, and then we uh, complement that with several other vendors, anything from uh, pasta to specialty foods to spices to honey, cookies. Uh, we have a chocolate person this year, and one of our new uh, vendors, um, Wolfgang Bakery, is uh, for the people that want to bring their dogs and get some doggy treats. So we have a little bit of everything for everyone. And Chris is a former president of the, of the Greater Westfield Area Chamber of Commerce. So Chris, tell us a little bit about the, the chamber, please. Um, yeah, so the, this is one of the events that we run. Uh, in addition to the farmer's market, we also run the uh, street festivals, the spring fling, and we also run the fall um, fall festival uh, here in Westfield. And then we also run uh, Garwood Rocks and Garwood. And this year we have a new event called Fan Jam over in Fanwood. So we run uh, various street festivals and each of them have a little bit of a different theme um, to uh, complement that particular town. But uh, all the money that we raise, we have a foundation and we give it to nonprofits and then we also support the uh, five high schools and we give scholarships to each of the high schools uh, that we represent for the various towns. And how many members do you have in your organization? Uh, approximately uh, 500, a little wow. over 500 right now. Well, terrific. Good luck this season. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. All right. Thank you, Chris. Thanks a lot. Right. I'm here with Vito. Vito's with High Mountain Foods. Has been a vendor here at the Farmers Market for probably about a dozen years. Vito, I've seen yeah, you here forever. A little over, a little over 12 years. Yes. Yeah. I sell kinds of crab cakes, ravioli, stuffed breads, Italian bread, eggplant rollatini, all good stuff. You know, if you don't like it, I tell people buy something else. No, but they're real good. You'll like everything you try. We also do the pickles and the olives. Best horseradish pickles around. Try them. Compare them to other people. You know. We have all kinds of desserts. We have all kinds of Italian bread like this, sliced bread, vanilla bread. Make a grilled cheese or toast, the best bread you'll ever have. You'll be spoiled with this, you know? I have focaccis, all kinds of focaccis with cheese, peppers and onions, with broccoli, with spinach. I have little baby ones without. We have all kinds of stuffed bread from chicken palm to meatball palm to everything. Over 40 kinds of raviolis that we make. If, 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 if it's food, we sell it. And where, where is your business out of you? We're in Roxbury, New Jersey. Okay. I tell people like a pack on people don't know where Roxbury is. I also have a warehouse in Pennsylvania, another one in northern New Jersey. You know, and people try our raviolis. Try my pumpkin raviolis, the best. Well, good. Well, well uh, it's good to see you again, right. and have a nice great have you. a great season, Vito. I hope you do good too. Uh, town's great. I love the people here. That's why I come here every month, right. you know, every week. Thank you, Vito. Thank you. I'm here with David from Chickadee Creek Farm in Pennington, New Jersey, my old stomping grounds. David, welcome to Westfield. Thank you. Great to be here. Yeah. Tell us about your produce here, please. Yes. Yeah, so, so we uh, just the first uh, first market here, and uh, we're in sort of spring gear. It's tomato season. So I'm sorry, uh, strawberry season. So uh, you know, it lasts about a couple weeks, um, and then. And, you know, it comes and it goes, but they're super sweet right now. Uh, we have a lot of greens, uh, typical of uh, early spring season, kale, chard, um, all sorts of herbs, basil, cut lettuce, head lettuce, and we have some plants over here as well if you want to grow your own uh, your own produce. So what, when you say organic, what's that mean? So um, organic means that there's no synthetic uh, pesticides, herbicides, fungicides applied at all. Um, it's also required to improve the soil fertility, so we're putting nutrients, compost, organic matter back into the soil. That really helps um, living life, like earthworms, um, you know, uh, bees, all sorts of, of, of life. It really helps the soil and the local ecology. So organics is geared towards, you know, sort of reinvigorating the natural environment. And how, how many acres do you have in Pennington? Uh, we have about uh, 15 acres. Yeah. Very good. Very good. Well, welcome to Westfield and uh, have a great season. Pleasure. Thank you to be here. Thank Thanks you, David. Appreciate it. Yeah. So I'm with Lori Hart from Donaldson Farms. Lori, welcome to TV36 and Thank to Westfield. You. Thank you so much. Good to be back it's to Westfield. Yeah. <laughs> so tell us about Donaldson Farms and uh, what, are you, what are you selling here today? Okay. Uh, we're just starting our season off today uh, with our, some of our produce, some is from South Jersey, ours is not exactly ready yet. We have vegetable farm, we have over 200 acres grown to vegetables, we're in Hackettstown. And you have some and beautiful flowers have, here too. Uh, beautiful flowers, we have a greenhouse on the farm, 
We have a farm market. We have pick your own strawberries right now. You can come out and pick your own, pick your own berries. Raspberries coming soon. Apples in the fall. And how long, how long have you personally been coming to Westfield? I think this is maybe our 14th year here. And you've been here all 14 years? I have been here all 14 years. Uh, well, that's terrific. Yeah, every well, Saturday. Good. Excellent. Well, it's yeah. good seeing you again. I see you here every year, and, yeah. and I hope you have good a terrific season. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you, you, Lori. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm here with Jay Bivakwa at Squeeze Fresh. Welcome, Sir. Jay. Welcome. Thank you. Appreciate it. So Glad tell, to be around. Yeah, tell us what you have here. we got a couple different varieties of lemonade. Uh, we have strawberry lemonade, the original limeade, and blue raspberry. All of them are made with our secret recipe that I couldn't even tell you, Mayor. <laughs> And how many years have you been coming here? Uh, this is actually our first year at this market, but we, I've been working for Squeeze Fresh for about four years now. Uh -huh. Great company, really excited to be here, looking forward to a great summer. And what's the, what's the best seller? Best seller is probably the strawberry lemonade, but my personal favorite, I would have to go with the strawberry limeade, mix it up a little bit more. Is that a pretty healthy drink? Uh, yeah. All of our drinks are made to your, uh, your request, so okay. uh, it could be sugar-free, it could be extra sweet. It's all yeah. up to you, Great. depending on how, how you like it. Well, good luck here with your first year. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you, Jay. So I'm with Julie from Patricia and Paul's. Of course, Patricia and Paul's is located in Westfield. Uh, and uh, Julie's been an employee there for about three years, yes. and, and now she, today she's working the farmer's market. Yes, this is my second year here at the farmer's market. Uh, we sell beautiful olive oil and balsamic vinegars. You're more than welcome to try any of them when you come to the market. So what's, what's your number one seller here, Julie? Uh, my favorite is the Tuscan herb. The number one seller is um, the garlic. Okay. And besides uh, vinegar and, and olive oils, what else do you have? We have some gift sets. We have beautiful gift sets that you can buy. Uh, hostess gifts if you go to somebody's home, mm -hmm. birthday gift. And we have beautiful stoppers for the olive oils, too, and the um, balsamics. That's terrific. And you're out here on this gorgeous day. Absolutely. Yeah. It wasn't too pretty here this morning, but it is now. Yeah, yeah. It turned out to be a gorgeous day. <laughs> yes, it did. But thank you. You're welcome. Good luck to you. Nice meeting you. Bye-bye. Right, I'm here with Michelle, who has another one of the owners of another downtown business, uh, Wolf Wolfgang Bakery and Grooming, right on right downtown on Broad yeah, Street. Right on East Broad Street. Yeah, tell us about your uh, your store, Michelle. So we are located right downtown. We have uh, gourmet baked treats that are all natural. We have dog food, dog accessories. We do dog grooming. So we do everything. We're just a little pet store. And you've been in town for how long now? We opened in November 2015, so a little over a year and a half. Okay. And how's how's so far? Yeah, it's great. We love Westfield, yeah. so. Great. And I, so what's your, what's your best seller here? Um, our little softies over here, those are our best sellers. Um, yeah, the dogs love them. I think with a cup of coffee, I, would, I would enjoy one yeah, of those. You can absolutely <laughs> have one. <laughs> and what about uh, besides bait goods, what else do you have? Uh, we have dog collars, accessories, we have dog food, um, and then we do our services, so we have grooming and all that stuff. Okay. And so will you be here every week, too? We will be, absolutely. Were you here last summer? No, this is our first year. Oh, well, very good, and good luck to you. Thank you so much. All right, thank you, Michelle. Thank Appreciate you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thanks. Good job. So I'm with Marty Schwartz. Marty's with uh, Unique Snacks of America. He's out of Cranford, New Jersey, our neighbor next door. And uh, I just tried some do a dog uh, snack over there. So now I can actually try a human snack. Marty. You can try a human snack, yes. It'll help make your, your hair as shiny <laughs> as the dog snacks will, too. These are healthier snacks for people. So tell us what you have here and what's your specialty? Well, well I am a snack researcher. Okay. So that's my uh, profession that I created because wow. I love snacking. Make America a snack again. Um, so no we, comment. Right. So we look around for interesting, healthier snack foods that are made by small companies in the U.S. Um, so these are potato chips that are kettle cooked right at the potato farm on Long Island. They use sunflower oil and then use the oil to run the farm machinery. So it's sustainable. Right. Um, these are organic granolas from Vermont. Um, we have a toasted coconut ginger and the original. Um, they also make, if I can hold this up, they make a bark, which is a granola with a layer of dark organic chocolate with different flavors. This is a cherry. We also have a coffee bean and a toasted coconut toffee. That looks delicious, Marty. It's, it's addictive, wow. believe me, very addictive. Um, and so, oh. so you're going to be here every Saturday. We're here every Saturday through October. And where else can this stuff be purchased? Well, right now we're at different um, street fairs, okay. and we're at craft shows later on as we get towards the holiday season. We're looking for retail space. Okay. If the rents are good in Westfield, we'll <laughs> open in Westfield. But we're also looking in uh, Cranford and, and Garwood. 
um, to have a brick and mortar store and eventually sell online as well. Yeah, very good. Well, thanks for talking with TV36 right, and good luck to by. you. All right. Thanks for doing this. Have a great summer here. Thank you. Chris, that was a lot of fun. I talked to quite a few vendors, some of our residents here, and I think it's going to be a terrific season for you. Yeah, we're really looking forward to it, and uh, the sun is always very helpful. Um, we're going to be running now uh, through the end of October, and then we have a special uh, market on the Saturday before Thanksgiving. So come out and join us every Saturday from uh, 8.30 to 1.30, and we will be having uh, various events throughout the season um, where we'll have some music, we'll have some events for the kids. Um, come and join us. Chris, terrific job managing this. I know it's a lot of work, so thank you uh, all for all you do. And, and yeah, the residents and local and from the surrounding areas, please come out. This is a terrific farmer's market with a lot of uh, good wares, delicious food and snacks and fruits and vegetables. Absolutely. It's all, it's all picked in the morning of. A lot of the farmers pick the stuff first thing in the morning. So come out and give us a try. I'm sure you'll be uh, pleasantly surprised. Great. Thank you, Chris. Good job. Thank you.